Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do a reading for Pisces. This is for Pisces, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus for three months from now. So three months from the date that you watch it. So you watch this just as this is an example. You watch this in April, May, June, July. So three months would be July. You watch this in May. This would be August. Keep in mind that this is just a prediction and I can't read for every single person. So let's just see what comes up for Pisces. Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Let's see. What do we got for Pisces? Three months. Three months from now. Oh, I'm not going <laughs> to... Look at that. They come flying out. I'm not going to do it. Big mess. Let's see if we can keep things together here. Remember, every word that comes out of my mouth, everything that happens is for you. So let's see if we can keep things together. Perhaps you've been in some sort of big mess. I don't know. Uh, I was able to hold it together, though, wasn't I? So what do we got? Destiny. This is good. This is the Wheel of Fortune. So this is a cycle that is coming to to an end. Uh, and a new one is beginning. So this is good luck. Good luck is on its way. The wheel of life is in constant motion. It's spinning in your favor. You may find yourself at the right place at the right time. This is a destined change, of course, that brings you something very positive. So this is a positive change. This is a reward of some sort. Okay, this is good fortune. Something very good is coming for you. Um, this is evolution as well. Evolving. Um expanding yourself starting a new life starting a new chapter of your life tens are completions you've have com you've completed something something sig significant now you're going to get some sort of reward this is a reward that is coming something very positive one card for pisces please what i just saw was the sun the sun is freedom, it's happiness, it's a yes, it's it's uh, great health, it's healing, it's very, very positive. Something positive is coming, it's a new day, it's a new beginning. Um, so it's a very positive uh, new beginning for you. Justice. Now this is a card of karma and this is a card of karma as well. So you may be dealing with some karma in three months or getting something that you deserve. Um, this justice is about karma. It's about getting what you deserve. All is fair. So this is, this is all is fair in, you know, the laws of karma and the laws of justice. Okay. Looks as though there's some sort of crash here. There's some sort of bang up. There's some sort of accident. Okay, looks like there's an accident here where there's maybe there's some road rage or, you know, somebody was tailgating and they run into somebody and an argument uh, breaks out. So be prepared. I mean, hey, that doesn't look good, does it? Um, so the law could get involved. The law could get involved. It looks like there's going to be some sort of argument that changes. And this is destiny, which is destination. So it, you may feel, you may get upset. You may get upset over a situation. There may be a fight. There could be um, an accident by the looks of things. But everything turns out as, as it should. Everything turns out as it should. Um, <laughs> now this is a card of consequences. So I'm not sure who is getting some consequences, but there's going to be some consequences. Obviously, somebody was going too fast. Usually, that's what causes an accident. They were moving too fast. So, I mean, I, I, my, my advice is to make sure that you aren't tailgating anybody. <laughs> okay, because that really looks like there's an accident and there's, a, there's an argument, you know, and the police get called or the authorities get called and they come to break it up. Um, so just, I mean, that's really what it looks like to me. Um, but justice is a card of everything turning out the way it should. Legalities. You need to be honest and upfront. You make sure that you try to control your, remember I said I got to keep it together. Make sure that you keep it together. Something is going to happen. 
that's going to happen. I think it has to do with driving somewhere because this is a wheel and these are wheels. Something about the wheel, you know, the wheel is spinning and maybe it's spinning too fast. So, I mean, I just got to give you that message. Be careful. If you are going too fast, the, you know, you could get yourself in an accident and there's consequences to pay. So, anyway, a um, couple of cards, please. You may want to control your temper. There's one, two, one more, please. There it is. Claw. Be careful. Do not take risks. You, you, I'm telling you what, you better slow your ass down. No offense or anything, but I really feel like there's, you know, you could get yourself in trouble. And, and this is, you know, somebody doesn't heed a warning. Seriously. Obviously this person has some place to go. They're not thinking. They're not worried about the law. They're breaking the law, obviously. Something to do with tailgating as well in a hurry. Nest, an emotionally secure, loving family is important to you. Well, family wishes come true. So this is some, you know, I think this might turn out in your favor if you can control yourself because I wanted to say that. So because this is the laws of karma, this is everything turning out in your favor and this is very positive. And these are very positive. Really, they are. Um, except for this one. Be careful. Do not take risks. This is a message. Don't tailgate somebody. Don't tailgate. Slow down. Be careful. Okay. Um, you want to protect your family. And a wish is going to come true. So there's some sort of family wish that is coming true. Hmm. What do we have for Pisces? Jeez, I'm pro oh, what a mess. Can't get them to shuffle. There's something going on here. What do we have for Pisces? Five of Pentacles. Now, the Five of Pentacles is hard times. Okay, it's hard times. It's financial burdens. Um, consequences, again, consequences. Um, something may cost you some money. And, and, hmm, something is going on here. You may be experiencing some financial burdens, burdens for acting recklessly. I've just got to be honest with you. I mean, this is uh, struggling. This is struggling financially. Seven of Wands. The Tower reversed. So you're probably going to experience a setback before this is up. Okay, you're going to be experiencing a setback. And you're probably uh, in defense mode. You're probably in defense mode. Everybody's point, pointing their finger at you. You're ready to battle. You're probably ready to battle. You're ready to fight. I feel like you are needing... You're going to need to defend yourself by the looks of things. There could be some court that is coming up. Something about defense. And this is defense as well. So you may be dealing with a very chaotic situation where something crumbles and it crumbles very, very fast and you are put in defense mode by the looks of things that are probably going to cost you some money. I think something is going to happen and you're going to be in fight mode. I think that you are definitely going to, this is, you're going to be in fight mode. Uh, life is changing. This is a profound life change. Okay. And this is a fight as well. You are going to be dealing with a fight, but everything happens for a reason. It does. This is this is a purpose. Everything happens. This is a reason. Everything happens for a reason. Um, so this is a painful change. You're moving. You never saw it coming. You never saw it coming. Somebody never saw it. Something is going to happen that you never saw coming. And you may be ready to fight. So it looks like there's going to be an argument. It has to do with a vehicle has to do with a vehicle tailgating or something like that or court um but whatever is happening is happening because it's time for you to spin that wheel it's time for you to go in a new direction it's time for you to go someplace else by the looks of things um hmm. six of pentacles the hermit two of swords now this is a decision 
a time to reflect, a need to retreat, a need to step back from the situation. This is a false sense of security that is crumbling and it's crumbling fast. This is like a permanent loss that cannot be avoided. And this is, this is uh, receiving something. It has to do with money. You're probably up against some stiff competition. You are. This is stiff competition. You are up against some stiff competition. I think there's a fight over money. There's a fight over who's going to pay what. You're going to need to think about this. You're going to need to take a step back and reflect. Time to withdraw. Withdraw. This is withdraw. You might want to withdraw from the situation. So that you can plan your next move. This is plan your next move. The Two of Swords is uh, a stalemate. A difficult decision to withdraw. You're dealing with some opposition. You are going to be dealing with somebody that some stiff competition and it may have to do with court or something that happens. You're going to be dealing with somebody that is highly competitive that is going to give you a run for your money. And it is a run for your money. Make You, you could get sued. I think that's what this is. Uh, somebody may, be, and then maybe it's your, somebody may be getting sued. I don't know who, or it's a fight for the money. It's a, it's a battle over the money. What the hell is this? It is, it is definitely, and it has to do with court or something like that, or legal matters. This two of swords is uh, being caught in the middle, in denial, inability to see the truth. Somebody is not able to see the truth and they need to take a time out to think about the truth. Hmm. Queen of Cups reversed. Oh my God. So this queen, of, this is somebody who is vicious. No offense to you guys. There's some sort of deep sadness here, disappointment. Um, there could be jealousy. There could be a victim mentality. It could be a very emotional time. This is somebody that acts out of revenge. This is a revengeful person that causes some sort of chaos, some sort of upheaval. I know it could be another water sign. It could be Scorpio. I'm not sure. This is Scorpio. This is Scorpio. But it could be a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. Could be you. This is somebody who is drowning in their emotion. Is very jealous. Very envious. Um, but the shower reversed is a very. It's a painful loss that cannot be avoided. And there, this is extremes. Extreme. Uh, extremely painful situation you're in, or extremely chaotic. You are going to be facing some sort of challenge with somebody who is fighting for the money or they're fighting, fighting. Yeah, this is about fighting for money. And this is financial loss, financial hard times, financial burden. Need to go within and reflect. You could be dealing with a Virgo as well. Time to reflect. Death. Death. Princess of Wands. And three of you can't this is somebody you can't work together with this is lack of togetherness lack of teamwork doesn't work well with others not on the same page you and it's going to cost you money there is somebody that is go, there's something that is going to happen it has to do with legal matters something is going to happen and i think there's there's this person i feel like you're dealing with somebody that is going to compete with you they're going to compete with you for the win okay this is about the win for the judgment to go in their favor now the death is is uh, in reverse is a disaster or an accident or an incident that causes upheaval and it's connected to this. So there is some sort of accident or death or situation that causes up. And it could be a death. I'm just saying, I'm just, I'm going to be honest with you. I know a lot of people don't like to hear honesty, but it's too bad. So anyhow, um, this is, this is a disaster of some sort. Something happens. An incident is definitely something is going to happen that 
you're going to need to take a time out and think about this. Think about your next plan of action because, you know, you're going to have to make a choice. This is a choice. Uh, and this is avoidance, avoidance, um, but you can't avoid it. You can't avoid, somebody's been trying to avoid, the, and, and you can't avoid, you have to deal with this. This is being torn, being torn between two, two relationships or two situations. This is to some sort of destruction. There's something. This is destruction right here. And a need for it to retreat. A need to withdraw. If I was you, I would withdraw. You're dealing with somebody that is highly competitive. Highly competitive. And I know you're like, I'm not withdrawing. Well, and like I said, I think I said earlier at the beginning, not heeding advice. If I didn't say it, I was thinking it. Anyway, the princess of, uh, princess of wands, that would be the page of wands. Somebody may make you an offer. You may want to consider it. You may want to consider the offer. All right. Um, this is this is somebody who's like I can. I'm I'm brave. I'm courageous, but doesn't work well with others. So we got somebody who are here who may think that they. Uh, well, this is a highly competitive right here. They may think that they can win, but it, mm, there's no compromising here. It's like no victory. There's no victory. That's a no victory. This is a big loss. Somebody that is very cocky. We have somebody here that is very cocky. They really are. Somebody here that is very cocky that is going to experience financial loss. This is a fail. I think that you, um, somebody is going to be, be experiencing a financial setback because of their a bit because they want they're in a hurry because they're in a hurry or they want to win they want to win at all costs they want to get in the front they want to take the lead they want to be on top and because they want to be on top it's like the universe brings takes them down because it's a universe card this is revenge we have somebody here that is revengeful There's no victory. There's no victory holding on to that money. Somebody is is the six of pentacles. That's about that's money. Okay. Receiving money, but there's no victory here. You may want to you want may want to reevaluate. This is sixes are about reevaluation. You may want to reevaluate and this is reevaluate this whole situation because this is going to be a the five of pentacles a loss. It's a financial burden financial ruin no compromise somebody that's unwilling to compromise unwilling to work with others and you're going to get an offer you're going to get an offer but you're, if you are if you don't compromise you could lose more than you even think so my advice is to compromise accept the offer because whoever you're dealing with is very stiff competition so I feel as though there's a loss of, of money here. I'm going to be honest with you. Four of Pentacles, Reverse, can't hold on to it. We have somebody here that is obsessed with money. And it's like they get into some sort of predicament where the law gets involved. Whether it's a contract, maybe they had some sort of contract, I don't know. And now there's a fight. There's a fight to, for justice. Okay, there is a, there's obviously a fight for justice. Everything is going to turn out as it should. 
there's going to be a difficult decision that is made that this will the a decision will be made and it may cause you to retreat you may you may be going your own way the hermit is going your own way you may be withdrawing from this whole situation with it feels like uh unhappily i don't think you're, it may be a bit not happy it may not be make you happy um but that is that is uh something turning out in your favor if if you can withdraw and accept the offer so pisces i feel in 3 months from now you're going to be dealing with some sort of crisis i'm sorry and i think this is a financial crisis that has to do with uh the law okay this the law or a contract or something like that i think this is going to um change your future it's going to change your destination because that is what that is the wheel of fortune it's going to change your future it's going to help you to evolve it's going to change your destiny it is it is that's the wheel of fortune um it's going to move you in a new direction put it that way you may be building someplace else, put it that way. So Pisces, I feel like you really need to be careful. Don't take any risks. In three months, we're talking about this July, August. I think that you're trying to build a strong foundation, but somebody is going about it in the wrong manner. I can't, I gotta be honest with you. You gotta come up with a plan. This is a plan. Now this is a Jesus consciousness as well. It's time to withdraw with others, completely go within and realize your true identity. And perhaps that is why this is happening. Now, this is about alone time. Maybe it's time for you. Maybe you're going to be going your own way. There is some sort of separation here with the tower reverse and the death reverse. There is a separation. Yes, there is. Family wishes come true. Well, family wishes come. Maybe this. Maybe you've been wishing. Maybe you've been wishing for freedom. Maybe you've been wishing f for uh, to break free from somebody. And this is the answer to your prayers. Something happens that, uh, changes your direction. Something like that. Um, there's somebody that has been staying in a false sense of security, avoiding, these are both avoiding, avoiding, uh, the truth, avoiding their feelings, avoiding how they truly feel, Probably, uh, you know, pretending they were happy, but it was all false. And now karma or destiny comes in and changes it so you can be who you truly want to be. That's exactly what this is, too. But it's going to hurt. I do think it... I'm sorry. I think it's going to hurt. I do. I think that... Uh, There's going to be a blow up by the looks of things. And there's going to be a stiff fight, stiff competition for money. Somebody could get sued. Or they're fighting for their share. Good luck. 